the company that started the A-frame camper craze back in a garage generations ago, A-Liner. Behind me, it has evolved to the Evolution E12. I'm Mikey B with Beckley's RVs. Let's go take a peek at this cool looking camper. A-Liner has evolved the A-frame camping to this cool camper behind me, the Evolution E12. We're gonna go through some of the main uh, features that are on the exterior right now, so to keep you comfortable and cozy at your campsites. Starting up front, you'll see a large uh, solar panel that fully fills that dormer uh, roof to get you that charge on those uh, weekends that you might go boondocking. But hey, if you're going boondocking, you're gonna need to take a bunch of stuff with you. We have the exterior storage compartments, three all together. This front one up in the front is nice and wide so you can get those wide uh, foldable chairs or those camping items in there nicely. Outside, if it's a nice day like we've got today, I've got, I have electric to throw um, maybe some music or some tunes on or a TV or heck, we're, we love camping and we love eating when we go camping, right? So we got to, our stove top, maybe throw out a flat top uh, electric griddle and get a nice meal going for, uh, for that weekend long. Got another storage door on the, uh, beyond this. I love the magnetic latch that they keep to it so that way if your hands are full with all that camping gear, you can throw it in without it coming down and bopping you on the head. Moving to the back side, you're gonna have your spare tire. And I've gotta mention, this big rugged tire is not just for the looks. It gives you a little extra lift. So if you're blazing the trails and you've got some um, cobblestones or some tree branches, things like that, you can go over it with confidence. Moving on to the off door side, we have all our hookups. I have a water hookup. I have a potable tank so I can take the water, especially if I'm boondocking. Your water heater, so that way you're, you're uh, easily um, soaping up your hands with some hot water to say sanitary. And heck, if you've got the big pots and pans so you don't have to drag them inside, you have an outside shower head that again, with hot and cold water, so you can do some of your dishes outside or maybe wash up some of those feet. Third storage door, again, for some nice um, uh, area to stow some items. And last but not least, we mentioned the solar panel. Here is a, um, a side access point. So if you have more solar uh, panels, maybe like the portable ones to bring with you to do a real long uh, excursion uh, boondocking, here you go to get that juice back into the ba uh, battery. So again, the A-Liner Evolution E12, some of the quick hot points on the outside. The cool A-Liner Evolution E12. It has evolved to an awesome A-frame camper. We're gonna show you some of the inside features on this camper, but before we go in, let me hit my touchpad on my secure RV lock keyless entry. Ha, follow with me. Starting up front, we have dormers on both sides, but the front dormer is a lot bigger, a lot taller to give me that uh, head height, especially if you're in and out of the dinette booth. We have a nice dinette booth that you can turn the table either uh, long ways or um, uh, width-wise with the booth to get two people or feet four people and more importantly this lays down to uh, lay the table down bring your cushions all in to form another bed if you, if you need but I do have to especially note why I'm up here with the dormers we have a hard sided dormer to give me that extra insulation factor give me some nice big windows that I can open up especially in that spring or fall camping season that we love that outdoor uh, weather to come inside our campers and and then of course for privacy, we have our curtains that we can close in behind us. Moving over to the kitchen area, I have my inside outside uh, two burner propane stove. So that way if it is a wet, uh, rainy day or maybe just uh, we've got a lot too much outside, I can cook inside or outside. It is not heavy at all and it has a quick connect that makes hooking up to our propane on board very easy, very efficient. Below the stove top, we have of course our refrigerator to keep some of our perishables nice, nice and cool through that long weekend that we're gonna be camping or keep our sodas uh, cold, right? 
need to wash up your hands or some uh, dishes or anything, we do have a water heater on board. So this um, uh, faucet will give us hot or cold water, but easily stows out of the way to double as some surface area if I need to do some prep for, for my cooking. And below that is gonna be an outlet that we have a couple um, um, spread around the camper. But I do have to note while we're down here, the interior of this camper is uh, composite material and all the cabinetry which is really cool we've got this big lifted camper we're going off the trails we're going hiking you know you're tracking in some mud man this will be such a delight easy sunday afternoon if we have to clean up and wipe everything down over here is going to be our controls for our air conditioner our heat for our fr uh, propane furnace and even the overhead um, fantastic fan and i have to say guys it's fantastic in my mind because it is fantastic the amount of air that it can pull out of here or crack a window open and, and cycle through is phenomenal and it only runs off a of 12 volt so that way you don't have to uh, rely on getting a campsite for electric as we move past the kitchen to the back <laughs> is going to be our uh, sleeper sofa. So you can sit here, chill out, read a book, maybe throw, throw some tunes on and just relax in the afternoon or in the morning. But this also doubles up as another bed. This will be uh, your bigger bed. So if a dinette up front would be, I would say like a double size. So two kids, maybe one adult or, um, but back here, you're definitely gonna be able to get two adults in this bed. And I'm 6'1", so I have definitely plenty of space, guys. I can throw my pillow, crack open some windows, and have a nice, cozy um, evening, weekend uh, sleep and, and just be recharged and ready to go for that Monday morning work office job, right? So there you go. You got a nice utility uh, style camper with a lot of outdoor uh, features that that way you can get home get cleaned up washed up and you don't you can get refreshed for monday morning the a-liner evolution e12 it is cool and awesome an evolved a-liner camper that is lifted to get you off the beaten path the features to be able to go boondocking like a solar panel and propane cooktop that's inside outside and a cool overall just neat look to it. The A-Liner Evolution E12, what do you think? Give us a like if you, you agree with us. Comment below any questions or anything that you wanna further see and show us some love, YouTubers. Smash that subscribe button. I'm Mikey B with Beckley's RVs. We'll see you at the campsites.